Hello everybody, welcome to this review of this modded Cambrook clock radio. Um, first of all, I'm going to tell you about the aerial. As you can see, I put, pretty much just put a new one on because the old one was cut off. I cut it off ages ago and I was little. Don't know why. <clears throat> but there it is now. It's probably about twice the length of the old one. And I just stuck it to the roof for good signal. And uh, I also put a new speaker in the damn thing. If you turn it upside down, you can tell I put some different screws in it because I lost the old ones. That one didn't quite go in. It's slightly too big. They're all too big, but I made them fit, except that one. But anyway, um, so I put a new speaker in it. And it sounds really good. Let's just turn it on. Turn, tune it in. Um, let me tune the damn thing in. See, as you can tell, that sounds pretty good, doesn't it? That's uh, tuned into 91.9 FM. You can't really see the clock, but it says 12.20. That's the thing I hate about that. It comes up in red, so you can't hardly see it during the day if the sun's on it. The sun's coming right in the window, and it's shining right across the clock, so you can't hardly see it. Oh, and the snooze button's broken. I broke that too when I was little. That's why my dad gave me this radio, because I broke it. He can't use it anymore. That button's completely fucked. Uh, excuse my language, but anyway. Um, uh, so, yeah, that's. Uh, I guess that's it. Um, the old speaker, I don't have it anymore. It's in the bin. Um, I did have a couple more speakers. I rather stabbed a hole in them. But anyway, so that's pretty much that. And, yeah, this is Lace Tart signing out. I hope you enjoyed, and uh, don't forget to subscribe.